My name is Keith Dunham, and this is my story. Basically, I grew up with a military family. We moved quite a bit, and we did not go to church. My parents weren't into going to church. So, you, so I had no, no history with church. Uh, then, basically last year, my wife almost passed away at Thanksgiving time. She was on life support. Uh, when my wife was in ICU on life support, I went to the chapel, chapel there and, and uh, prayed to God to either save her or, or take her to heaven. Um, and I made a, a deal with God, or I, I tried to make a deal with God. And I said that if he would let her wake up, I'd start bringing her to church. And she did wake up, and we started to come to church. Uh, the first time my wife and I visited Bethlehem Community Church, uh, she loved it. She loves the stained glass windows. That's really the reason we came. Um, of course, since I never had any relationship with God, I was really felt out of place. Uh, we kept coming back. I mainly did it to please my wife, but I don't know, it wasn't too long that I started to want to be here and want to come, come down here. I knew something was going on. I didn't know what it was. Uh, just right after the 4th of July, my wife had to go up to Pennsylvania uh, to visit family and she was going to be in gone a week or 10 days or so and well it just kept going another week another week and two weeks and finally I got a call from her and it was bad news she decided she don't she don't want to leave Pennsylvania she don't want to move back home uh, when I first got the news I felt like I got ran over by a truck um, the first Sunday after I got the news from her, I, I, I honestly didn't know what I was going to do because I didn't understand. I'd been coming to church and I guess I, you know, felt a little angry at God because I've been coming to church and this is kind of like how he thanks me. Uh, but the next morning I got up and I knew I was wrong for what I thought of the night before and I put my clothes on and I happily came to church. Um, I continued on trying to learn about God. About a month ago, I'm sitting in service, and I, I really don't remember what Pastor Jamie was even talking about. My mind was just lost. I, you know, I just didn't know what to do. I knew I had to be here at church. Uh, I knew my wife wasn't coming back, and I knew that. I, I couldn't go back to the person I used to be. I just couldn't do it. And I, I needed something more in my life because I was not fulfilled in my life before. So I came up here and asked to be saved and, and prayed and I'm ready to begin a new chapter in my life. I want to get baptized because throughout my life I've put a lot of walls up. I've had a lot of trust issues. Um, I have sinned a lot, I need a new beginning, and I love God, and I need God to wash away my sins, and I need Him to tear these walls down for me. I want a relationship with God, and I want to serve God, because I love God, and I'm also tired of being a scared little boy, I want to be a, a strong Christian man in, in, in the church.